Vuta mbele, vuta mbele. Vuta mbele. Just slowly, slowly, slowly. There. She's there. That's a bush part. Oh yeah, she's red. She's yeah. red. So that is the bush back here, Femi. No, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, a minute. wait, wait, we'll move ball. We'll pull forward. Go down into her to come here. I said, how she's moving. Okay, we'll move forward a little bit before she disappears. Now you can all see, she's there. That's a female. That's the female. That's the female bushbuck. Female bushbuck. Yeah. The male do have horns, and female doesn't possess horns. Bushbuck. They. And maybe she was out of the bush to drink, and she will go back into the bush. You will never find that bushbuck outside, or in an area where there is no trees or bushes to hide. We have water bath, they hang around the water holes. With bush bath, they hang in or in the bushes. So when, you can, when they come out of the bush, they're easier prey. Yeah. Because I, I look at the, it's so thick in there, it's hard for even a lion to chase anything down. If it's out of the bush, it's in danger. That's why even if they come out of the bush, they make sure that they're close to the bush. Right. Sure, and I had a quick question now. So there's no lions in this park, are there lions? We have lions. Or maybe we just never seen them so far. Mm. Now with you, we have never seen, but I have seen lions here. The number is not big as in the Serengeti, but we have lions. We have leopards. Oh, so we're going to we're going to encourage the, um, to everyone to join the Serengeti tour. You going to do that? No, yes. they're doing it. Uh, I'll promote it, um, recruit the We're people, doing it, but if and then I'll send him, the people. Come to us. Oh, so I'm gonna, I just gotta update the stuff on the website. Okay, that I would Because um, I would do that. this this introduces us, but then it doesn't give you enough. So it kind of it, it makes you want it makes you want you, you want more. Did you want to do this? Yeah. And I'm learning that too. I was never into animals or parks and things. But you weren't. No, no, I don't think I would like it. But I actually once I did it. Yeah, once I did it, once I went to Kenya, and did it. Oh, I don't like zoos anymore. I actually could do it. Oh, the same yes. Yeah. Yeah. Almost do. It's true. Um, when you see them, the lions. You remember uh, uh, Melissa, the sister babies, we met in Dar es Salaam? Melissa, yeah. You yeah. Have she, she came for safari. I don't like I'm happy that she did. That's just a sister, sister Melissa. Came. Yeah, she. We zoos. met one of uh, yeah. African American yeah. ladies yeah. in Dar es Salaam. Which first tour yeah, went over for a bunch of years. As we was in Dallas, we met uh, a lady with her this. two this boys. Is really she is from America. Mm -hmm. And, and uh, for money, he explained that uh, we do safaris, we go to the bush. And she said, I want to go. And I thought that's a joke. She took my number, and then three days later, she told me, said, I'm in Arusha, I want to go to Tarangiret. But you yes, never informed me ahead of time. Yes, yes, but anyway, we can do it. So then I picked her from a hotel. We had to tell her she loves it. Think she'll tell somebody else. And that means no, she, 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 really she is sending. Um, she sent three people. Uh, she explained to her friends, and three of them are coming in February. There you go. That's, all, that's the networking, brother. We're gonna expand on it. Yeah. Because I'm gonna really put it out there on the, on the, the site and other places. Because this is just uh, yeah, I got a butt. <laughs> so family, I, I know I got a butt. we're gonna be doing full fledged <laughs> safaris. You know? We're gonna be hooking it up, and we have our incredible crew here in Tanzania that's gonna yeah. get you there. I gave up. I couldn't. Yeah, me too. I gave up. Yeah. It really was. It really was. Hard. You got to get the best. I got it. I got that way you can see. You know. The real deal, and it's something where it's um, the average day for safari is about five days. Five days, five to seven days. Yes, so five. That's when you're saying five, that is four nights, five days, and then we have five nights, six days, and then we have six nights, seven days. There you go, family. That's like a that's like a good amount of our trip. So that's why we're gonna offer some options. So yeah, uh, that, yeah, because if you 
staying for six nights, seven days, it gives you almost two nights in every park. That means you start with Manyara, it's small one night, and then you go to Serengeti for two nights, that's three, and then you come to Gorongoro for two nights, that's five, and then Tarangire one night, that's six, and the seventh day you drive back to Arusha. That is beautiful, man. That's a lot of movements there. Yeah, yeah, and you can have it in a budget level, mid range, and high end. Family. That's what we're going to be doing, family. We're going to keep you posted. We're going to offer some incredible options. Always the private tour. It's easier to do for those number of days, like two, maximum of six in the car. They can easily do safari, Serengeti, Morongoro, Manyara. And if the people do have enough number of days, they can have first, first tour, like Climatization day, like yesterday, we stayed in Arusha. We can come in Arusha National Park for a day trip and then back to Arusha and then go to Tarangire and Gorongoro and Serengeti. I love, I love the schedule, man. I love it. So that's what we're doing, family. I'm going to get the S22. I might be doing it. In Tanzania, exploring and learning and looking to expand the energy and operation. Because the camera on this is blue. That's called learning and discover. And then I can still on the dirt road making our way around the park and family it is nature at its finest north there's greenery everywhere is it not in the city no it's out it's out it's bordered in Gorongoro and Masai Mara in Kenya it is yeah what kind of vehicle if you want to be in Serengeti only Serengeti you need five nights that's what I heard it's its own Serengeti is huge because if you have two nights, you will only stay in the central part of Serengeti. But if you do like what we call it this Serengeti tour, you have Serengeti North, you have Central Serengeti, Serengeti West, and Serengeti South, and that you cannot cover in two nights. Oh, you do those Yes. So like, and what come here? That's that's what I have been doing for since 2001. And wow. in the vehicle you showed, right? Yes. So how far is it from here? The vehicle takes maximum of six. How yeah, far is it from that's what I was in. From how far is from it's here? Serengeti. You talking of 320 kilometers? That's hours. like up to nine hours drive. Oh. But we don't do that. You cannot do that in one day. So you would driving fly from, in there. You can make drive in, fly out, or uh, fly in, drive out. Why am I saying try in, fly out? It's like you start from Tarangire, Arusha Tarangire, Manyara, Gorongoro, Serengeti, and then you fly from Serengeti back to Arusha. Or else, you fly from Arusha to Serengeti, and then you start from Serengeti, Gorongoro, Manyara, Tarangire, Arusha. So that you are not repeating the same route. It depends on your budget. The people pay the budget safari of Four nights, they go all the way to Serengeti. And some people go for mid-range, that's driving, drive out. People want the high-end luxury safari, they do one way. Drive in, fly out, or flight in, drive out. So it depends on what you want. Your budget will determine what you get. So what is the closest um, uh, airport to the park? In the heart of Serengeti, in the middle of Serengeti, we have Seronera Airstrip, yeah. where even Precision Air lands there. The flight, the flight that you're taking from Arusha to Zanzibar, it also lands into Serengeti and fly from Serengeti to Zanzibar. So you're not coming back to Arusha if you're flying from Serengeti to Zanzibar. You fly straight to Zanzibar, okay. or you can take if like the, your 15. That's more than the, this. This you can you can. Some people do chatter. They chatter you to. Yeah, but we have scheduled flight that is from 10 in the morning. Uh-oh. How are you doing? What's going on? Right. Slow it up, sir. <laughs> huh. but is so is it, is this the same vehicle you saw okay. about? I'm, I was showing some of that's you the picture. That's the type of safari vehicle. That's what I was saying. So it, it, is it six that's people plus had. a driver? Mm -hmm. Yes. And that's what I was oh. in King, yeah. So why are they at the top right there? there are those chairs? That's an open top. You There's can stand on it. So the Let's film so them like see, let's film them see, like I like to seats, film people. The number of seats oh. inside. <laughs> so everyone has got a guaranteed window seat. Okay, so you have a window because I was in three, three 
three types. I was totally open with it, just go up the top. Totally open. But those vehicles cannot do the long tour. So it's within the park. Right. So that was Lewa, and then I was Lewa. one like Lewa, and I was one like that in, I think in Masamara? I'm trying to remember. And then Ambusili was totally different. It was more closed in. Yes. It was South, yes. South Africa. Yeah. Because that was not a national park. That was a, a conservation area. Conservation area. Yes. Right. Right. So I, we were in three different types, but in Lewa, it was totally open. Yes. Totally. And then we saw three lions that I'm, my arm was like this, and it was totally open. We just had rolled up tarps, and there was lions coming this way. And I slid my seat over this way, like that was going to do any no, good, that's but, you that, know. My, my last safari, we had a cheater on top of the I did, I slid where you were sitting. Wow. I was on the right, over the to where he's standing. Like, that's going to help. So, family, everything that they talk about is not what we're going to do here at the National Park. But if you want more, we got to take you to the next level. If you want more, come to Serengeti. Here you go, family. It was totally but this is kind of like a nature drive around the Arusha National Park. Uh, sometimes you have seen a lot more animals than other times. Jump to the roof because she was using our cars at Lookout Park. And three lines which to buy right. So she and was interested. So the people that were taking pictures were back in. Right? And the, the first minute they came in and they were scared and said, "Don't worry, take photos." And they were like, "Face to face with the cheetah." Only and thing I asked them is not to scream. Now what with that? And screaming would threaten the animals. I saw a baby owl. I saw a baby push back. Is that baby push back? It was a running fast. There's one in South Africa. We had one that we had spy on. That only had where we stopped. We had turned into money. You're feeling good. You're enjoying the breeze. You're trying to 